ask a question. Um, I think we've all probably had this conversation. Can you ever be too nice to be successful to date? We're going to go toe to toe on this. It comes from a blog, The Zeros Before the One. That's the name of the blog. One writer says that women don't reject guys for being nice. Ni women don't reject? See, I think they do. I, nice is code for being needy, boring, or insecure. Her words, not mine. Not mine. No, no, keep reading. Keep reading. Keep reading. It's also code for being, this is not my words, socially awkward or bad in bed. I did not say this. I do not believe this. I, I love nice guys. They finish first. But, uh, oh, yes, Scotty, you are a nice guy. You are the nicest of all guys. So um, is being nice... Is it, does it mean that you're, that you're getting pushed around? Does that push you into the friend zone? That is what we ask today. I think Lara just went toe-to-toe -to -toe with herself. I did. I just had a, so. I did, I'm so. <laughs> We've got two guests to help continue the dialogue that Lara's having with herself. <laughs> Funny people both, D.L. Hughley and Susie Essman, everybody. <laughs> That, uh, I think that a lot of girls are attracted to the bad guy, and I, I wish that we would celebrate nice. Why guys. can't you be a nice bad guy? Why are they? Why don't they go together? Why can't I, I you be? I think they can, and I think why, they. I mean, when I first met my husband, the thing that attracted me to him was he was kind. That's same with me. He was very kind, but he's a bad boy. You know, he's a <laughs> rebel, and he's and he's anti-authoritarian, and he, he, you know what I mean. He always goes against the grain, but he's a kind, nice person. Why can't you be both? Have you ever had a friend? He else both. Well, have, I, I think the thing about. Uh, Women is either you're kind of in charge or they're in charge. That's the way that goes. Like, uh, really, it's not a partnership. No, it's not. The women say partnership. No, it's not. <laughs> um, and women like, not, like, like uh, every every woman wants a bad guy till they got to get a restraining order. And then, <laughs> It's not, it's not sexy. And then it's not so fun not so, when yeah, you live in, yeah. in an undisclosed location with your parents. It's not. Yeah, that's not, a, that's not a fun date and, in and a full we, wig. But women bring a lot of this. Women, the one thing a woman won't forgive you for, you, you could be forgiven for cheating, you could have a drug problem. Wait, wait, wait. If you, yeah, no, you no, can't wait, be wait, forgiven wait, wait. for cheating. If you, if you bore a woman, she, yeah. boring is, you, it's no rehab for boring. Right. <laughs> You, I'm, I'm serious. I've known people to do anything. Women hate you for being born more than almost anything. They would, they, they'll leave you. You know what? I have a born. code word for my husband when he goes on long-winded stories. I just look at him. I just say, "Glazing." <laughs> it just means my eyes are glazing over. Move on. <laughs> but we're comedians, so we're always. You always got to get to the right. punchline, you know. But does it annoy you? Do you have any friends who sort of always shun the quality guys to go for the guys that are you need restraining orders? But here's, but that, here's the difference. What you're talking about is you're talking about abusive guys. That's different than no. Than I want to focus on nice. the nice guys. Well, you could be nice and and not be boring. You could be nice if, if you're meaning nice as needy and namby pamby and wishy washy and obsequious. Ugh. But nice could also be you know Josh is perfectly nice. Yes. <laughs> Well, until we see Josh with the scroll under him going, oh, wait, no. <laughs> no, I think there is a distinct difference. And women women are not a Like, you got to be mysterious, which means yes. you got to disappear for three or four days with nobody knowing where you're at. That's just so <laughs> where you're at. So, and because you, he's... He's a very nice fella. He's also got a book called Shut the F Up. So yeah. I'm just there. Is a, so what's wrong with that? No, nothing. That, nothing. He's That's a, he's, that fun edge that we're talking and, about. But that doesn't mean he's not nice. No, he could no be, we're not saying. We yeah. just say he's the, among so, the nice well, women ass. want a sensitive guy to somebody breaking the house. And then, like, hey, a well, song of roses everything. ain't going to help want, get him out of your bedroom. Right. So, we want women want to yeah. feel protected and, and right. like, they're, you know, we're, there's someone sort of bigger than us. Yeah. We, but you know what? What we want is we want oh, a no. guy. We want a real guy. I, 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 see, here's the thing. My experience, I'm married. I'm, I'm married to a black woman who had been for a long time. And the, the way, uh, I'm telling you, either, either you're in charge or she's in charge. It's like, uh, it's like a, a, a death match. Um, that we never so who's win. in charge? That, that we you never, never win. win. But you kind of so no. you, you, At a certain point, you have to step up and be in charge. I, I think women like men who take uh, a charge. They like men who, who are assertive. They also like men who, who they feel like can take care of. So I yes, think. but they also want to be able, when need be, to get their own way. So you, it's a balance, like everything. All right. Mm. You know, you don't know you think it's, it's a balance? Yes, and I also want 
uh, unicorns and rainbows right. and pots of gold. See, that's yes. a turn off to me, Josh. <laughs> unicorns? Yeah, not, total, not your thing? No. Total, if you're a unicorn rainbow right. guy. Have you uh, scratched the unicorns? It'll be unicorn free our first date, Susie, I promise. You gotta stop drinking because I've seen unicorns. <laughs> Susie Essman co-headlining two shows next week, one in Burkin County, one at Purchase College. You can catch DL, meanwhile, on The Endangered List, Comedy Central, October. Thank you both. Yeah. Yeah.